This one's for you guys out here that's always chasing that horsepower, the gains, any means that you can get it from, whether you're changing your air filter, doing a slip on or full system, you're getting a little bit more power. This one's for you. We're gonna be installing the Sprint Filter P08 on the Ducati Street Fighter V4S. It's something that's gonna allow the bike to breathe a lot better. The engine's gonna get a lot more air. And one thing that we love about the Sprint Filter here at Motivation USA is the ease of use and the ease of maintaining it. So no fuss, you know, no oils. Every time you do your oil change, if you want to, you just pull it out of your bike and get a air blower and dust it off and throw it back on and you're back on the road and you're getting a little bit more bang for your buck on your engine is breathing better, getting a lot more air. For you guys, definitely we highly recommend getting that Sprint filter. Let's get to it. We're gonna work, work our way on the two screws that are here. They're not like super tight. side of the bike you're gonna turn the steering column and then we're gonna do the other two bolts that are here so now in order for us to get to the air filter you have to scoot over the air box forward on both sides that is there you go now we have that crack open a little bit you're gonna go to the opposite side it's gonna be easier to pull it from there turn the steering column all right so now we're on the opposite side I feel like it's gonna be a little bit easier to get to I'm gonna shimmy that forward box and there we are from this point here you should be able to see the air filter just gonna try to shimmy that out so the trick is to kind of put the steering column somewhat centered push on one side and then you'll be able to get a better grip to shimmy the rest of it out it is really tight man getting through here so Okay. This is the OEM. That's OEM. This is the Sprint. You can see through that. And this is the OEM. Okay, so there we are. You're going to slide that in. Same thing. Slid right in perfect. I'm gonna check the opposite side to make sure that it's good. Okay, should look right here. Perfectly placed. Flush into the mount. If it's placed properly, guys, you should be able to see right through to the opposite side. You know it's flush into the actual uh, slot it's supposed to fit in, All right? So now I'm gonna move the two covers back into space and then tighten things down. They're not fully tight, just dropping them in and then hand tighten a little bit. Okay. Gonna drop the screw. 
screws into this one. Okay. Now we're gonna get a little tightening over here. These weren't super tight, so just keep that in mind. You don't have to go crazy tightening them down. There you go. Now we're gonna tighten these little bad boys up real quick on this side. Super easy installation on the Street Fighter V4S. It might vary based on the motorcycle you're currently riding, but for the Street Fighter, it's an easy, easy, easy mod that you can do it yourself. One tip that I have to mention, make sure after you install the air filter with the Street Fighter, you let the bike run for about 15 minutes, let the fan kick on and then turn it off, allow the fan to stop running and then rerun the bike again. Basically the ECU is relearning how the bike is taking in the air with the new filter. So just a quick heads up, you don't have to do anything special, just that you need to do after doing it and then the bike will know what's going on. All right, yeah man.